Welcome back guys, this is Henry1502 Inc. I'm back and I know I took like a month month and a half long break but I'm back. Um I've basically been studying, trying to test my way out of certain college classes with with still getting the um three credits. Some of you guys are familiar with um CLEP tests. That's pretty much what I'm doing and it's hard because you have to teach yourself and all this stuff and it's it's complicated. Um, but right now I am continuing my Code Academy series and we're in the second Whoa, my alarm just went off. We are in the second section of JavaScript introduction to uh, functions in JavaScript and we are working with functions and returns. So pay attention. Um so what does problem set wants us to do is they want us to create a new function called orange cost and this is how you create a function if you guys don't know what I'm doing I'm going to ask you guys to go back to my tutorials and learn everything that you need to learn um, but right now we're telling the function what to do whenever we call a price and what it's going to do is price times five semicolons the number one biggest mistakes that people tend to overlook so what we have right here is we're telling JavaScript that we're making a variable we're naming the variable we're telling JavaScript that this variable equals a function and we just put in a parameter if you don't know what a parameter is go back to my tutorials you should find out what it is um, and we're logging it out in our console so it's going to be price times 5 but if you run it you're going to get an error message why is that well I'm going to tell you why you get an error message you get an error message because we're multiplying this um, we're multiplying price times 5 we don't even know what price is so we have to call up the function and tell it that orange cost equals five. So basically, price is a placeholder for whatever number we want to put in it or letter we want to put in it. So like if we wanted to put in a letter, we would just put um, the two apostrophes. I guess that's what it's called, but that's not what we want to do. So run the program and you will get correct 25 so basically it multiple we gave we gave this a value and it just multiplies it by five so that's pretty much all we did there continuing on to number two um they pretty much have this all done for us but i guess they just wanted to see if we are smart enough to know what functions are and how to call them and if you were paying attention you should know that it's as easy as one two um let's say three online a 